Think about how, ladies, pay attention. Think about how we are to our husbands. Perhaps a lady may be reciting the Quran thinking she's reciting it beautifully. But is she making tilawah? Is she implementing the book of Allah? Is she following the book of Allah as it relates to her husband? فَالصَّالِحَاتُ قَالِكَاتُ الْحَافِظَاتُ لِلْغَيْبِ بِمَا حَفِظَ اللَّهِ The righteous women, they are قَالِكَاتُ قَالِكَاتُ means obedient, devoutly obedient to Allah and to their husbands. They are obedient to their husbands. Dutifully obedient. They preserve in His absence what Allah has ordered to be preserved, meaning his wealth, his property, her chastity. She preserves in her husband's absence his honor, his property, his house, his children, and so on. The Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, خَيْرٌ نِسَاءِ امْرَأَةٌ إِنَّ بَرْكَ إِلَيْهَا سَفْرَتْكَ The best of women is a lady that if you look at her, she's pleasing. She pleases you. وَإِنْ أَمَرْتَهَا طَاعَتْكَ and if you order her with an order, she obeys you. And if you are absent, like you traveled, and you're absent from her, then she preserves herself, and she preserves his property. She preserves her property and his property. She preserves the house. She preserves his honor and so on. From our Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, so we find people who may read the Qur'an, but how are they with their husbands? Are they devoutly obedient to their husbands? Or is this recitation of the Qur'an just reading something like a newspaper? Something that doesn't affect our lives? You may find them saying to their husbands, get away from me. You may find them saying to their husbands, don't ask me for that, I'm busy. You may find them saying to their husbands, let me tell you what to do. Because some of us have been poisoned by the Western environment that we live in. Let me tell you what to do, O oh husband. Let me take control of this marriage. And some women think that that's their role in a marriage, to challenge the authority of the husband, and to try to take over the direction of the marriage, and to be the leader of the marriage. When Allah Ta'ala has made the husband in charge of the marriage, and has made the husband in charge of the wife, and has made the woman responsible and accountable for obeying the husband, they wish to turn the tables. Where's the tilawah? Where's the real tilawah of the Qur'an? Where is it the one that Allah has described that this is the tilawah of the believers? Those who apply, implement, and follow the book of Allah as it has been revealed to be followed.